Okay, so this is something I'm trying out as a new thing. I've just played a game in uh, the Fumble Cup on Fumble, obviously, and now I'm going to do a quick replay of it and do a sort of highlights package kind of thing and see how that goes, because it's a pretty cool game, actually. Um, I um, So if we just run through a little bit, I am... Um, where are we? There we go. So I'm the Amazons um, against his uh, Chaos. His Chaos are pretty uh, hardcore. They've got some stars back there, so they've got Frenzy, blah, 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 nasty, horrible people, blah, horrible, horrible. Uh, I've got just a, f a few skills on my block, and um, I've got this quite nice guy back here who's got Ag4 guy, gal, um, and she got Guard first. And then frenzy, and then she got agility four. So bit of a bit of a weird piece there, but these things happen. Um, so yeah, so I took a wizard and a um, and a bloodwiser babe. Interesting, it doesn't show the wizard on the replay, but the wizard should be down there. So I got a wizard and a bloodwiser babe, and I won the toss, and I elected to uh, receive the ball. Which is not something I wanted to do. I would normally do. I normally kick, um, but when I have a wizard, I quite like receiving. So the sort of the wizard threat is there for as long as possible. I also had this chappy, Helmet Wolf, um, and I find he's better if you receive as well because it means you can have a long drive with him on um, rather than and it sort of gives you control of the game basically. Um, so yeah, so it started off and I um, play. There we go, um, and the first few turns sort of went along. KO'd that guy, which was quite cool. So quite a nice little start there. Um, and nothing. All right, so that was that was an interesting little bit. Uh, he tried to take out Helmut. Um, so basically, he was on a he was on a mission, predictably, to take out Helmut. Um, and so he comes in there and blitzes Helmut, um, but only manages to get a pushback. And he stands firm, and then he has to dodge out because he's already used his reroll. Um, so that was quite cool. That was his first hit on helmet, and then I sort of did some attacking kind of stuff. Um, if we wander through here, um, knock the guy there, and then I'm going to do a foul, you know, attack with helmet there, and then try and pr sort of protect helmet a little bit. He's going to have to basically if he's using his blitz on helmet, he's not using it on anything else. And helmet had a bit of a uh, a life. Uh, lifeline really he had a bit of a charmed existence because he got whacked a few times and didn't 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 go out so that was quite cool um, and then he was a little bit out of position so I, I could sort of move down the sort of side a little bit um, I'll move my players a little bit down so actually I wasn't trying to progress too much at this at this stage um, he's coming in there Right then, I had quite a nice little turn here. He blocked, and then I sort of managed to get a little bit of progress down here, and then killed a, killed his superstar player. That was pretty awesome. So this is the guy um, who had. Uh, it wasn't that guy. It was the guy who ended up in reserves. So frenzy block, piling on mighty blow. Um, yeah, nice player to kill, but he he came back sadly. Um, so that was quite cool. And then knocked him over, and started to move down the side. Chainsaw attack there. He's still doing well. Um, it's a bit worried about Faludi getting whacked there, but only the push or the push pow. And uh, oh no, it was just a push. In fact, a push and a both down. Um, so Faludi lived to fight another day, despite the horrible guy attacking. Right, and then he sort of got a few players in the way there, but not really enough. I thought so. I, I should have been able to make a bit of progress here. Now I don't think I played this turn spectacularly well, so I brought my guarder into there and knocked him. Um, and then let's have a look what I do here. Um, ah, this is where it all went slightly wrong. Right, so I've got my frenzy piece and I got the pow there. Now that was the thing that I wasn't hugely expecting. I was expecting... Ah, I see where I went wrong. I powed to there. I should have powed. Um, there, I think that comes up on the screen, doesn't it? Yeah, I should have powered down right, because then I could have followed and retreated. As it was, I powered to there, and then I had to go this way. So that was a mistake that I didn't pick up at the time. So I had to. So I could either go back there for the three up, or I could go there for the. And then basically he did that, and this guy's just going to come down and smack, my, smack my dude, which is a bit of a shame. 
Uh, so here he comes, pow, destroyed, boom. And then the crowd decide to throw in the ball, so it's, did it scatter off? Yeah, it scattered off, and then they threw it back in two squares to Balder the Doombringer. Thanks, crowd. Um, and then, he, But he doesn't have that good a turn to sort of follow up, really. Um, doesn't do very much at all. And then I managed to right, let's see what happens then. So I just knock that guy down, and then these dodges work quite nicely. So he comes around to this. There's a Garda, movie, and then that dodge works as well. One dice, close down, re-rolled to pow. Quite nice. And then comes to there. So I'll try and pick it up. Fail, but I'm a guarder. Um, with a si sorry, guarding sidesteps. So I'm not worried about being on the side of the pitch, particularly. Um, comes around there, tries to sort of protect the ball. Nothing much happens. Tries to pick it up, fails. Right, so fail to pick up the ball, bounces to the beast. And this is where I think... I could either have accepted that I was going to go in at the nil-nil and then worked it from there, but I thought it was worth a pop to go in one nil. So that comes the wizard, smack, bang, and the ball goes down, which is quite cool. So I managed to knock that guy over, which is pretty cool, and then do a bit of consolidation and pick up the ball. All right, so I've got it. Uh, safe there, so this one could dodge out on a 4 plus and go for the blitz um, and try and get like a both down maybe, but I've got a few rerolls, so that would have been a 3 up for the score if, he, if he'd done that or, you know, tried to get the pow but the pow, you know, 1 in what is it, 21 in 36 to get the pow um, so instead just smacks that one and this guy's a tackler and it also killed my guy there it's a bit of a blow um, and so just sort of puts a bit of pressure on. Quite a nice little turn there defensively, sort of defensively. Um, saves the reroll, interestingly, with that dodge. So this guy dodged out, and he only had one reroll left, and he saved it um, for what will come next. Um, so I f use this guy to free up this chap, this girl. Comes down here, smacks. I hope for a pow there, or, or, or a dodge pow, and then I have to dodge out and make the score. So that goes in. Um, so I've got a 1-0 there. So I just set up all my players back except for the three sort of cannon fodder on the line. And then he sets up. So he's set up He's set up for the smack there. So let's take it back just a little bit. So he's basically just set up for the smack. Just loads on the line. Smashy smashy. But then what happens? It's a quick snap. Oh no! It's quite interesting. Because they get to move in a whole load of stuff. And it's a touchback as well, so that was a really poor kick from me, but I had kick, um, and I figured it didn't matter, so I kicked quite. So that was a horrible combination of things, so it needed the six on the kickoff um, table, so the kickoff on, on the kickoff scatter, and the quick snap, and then this guy's got move seven, and so this is quite a nice little move here, so he's got the push there, and the pow. And because it's the quick snap, the blitz has not been used. So the push goes there. And he comes around this guy. Go for it into there. Still no um, reroll used either. It's into there. And that's the that's as far as they need to go. There's the timeout, interestingly. Right, this is a bit of a recurring theme with this one, that uh, the opponent was sort of going over the four minutes quite regularly. But I was being quite sporting, I thought and uh, not timing out. But there we go, there's the blitz. Um, two dice because of the horns. Three up dodge because of the two heads. Two up dodge with the go for it as well. Scores without using any re-rolls. We go in one all, and I've used my wizard. So, bit of a blow there, and I'm kicking now. Uh, so I set up, um, and I kick it short. I quite like kicking short with kick, um, just on the off chance that I get a blitz. And then it means that if you get a blitz, it's good. Whereas if you kick deep, then blitz can sometimes be a bit blare. But if you, I think if you kick short, then a blitz generally is awesome. Um, especially with only a couple of, sort of rookies bare, basically. I would have been able to swarm and get the ball. Um, so we'll see what happens. Uh, I've left my AG4 um, blitzer here, which is a bit of an error. Um, 
I don't know why. I think I was a bit disappointed after the one turn um, score. Um, so brain was not working very well, and for some reason I'd set I've saved this as a setup previously, um, with my agility four able to be hit. Um, but he didn't do that. He uh, he blitzed this top, this person instead. Um, bit of a KO there. Um, and then fails the pickup, quite key. So now, if we s analyse this situation, he's failed the pickup there, the ball's there, and he's just got these guys, and I've got probably one of my best players there, guard sidestep. So let's see what happens on this turn. So I'll do anything else first, because it's all dependent on what happens here, really. I get the pow, which is lovely, bounces to there, bounces onto my guy, onto his guy, and then over to there, which is quite cool. Um, so it's definitely gettable. I've got my sure hands thrower there who can sort of nip in and throw it back. And so there's my agility four, goes as the receiver. And then I just bring a f couple of players around. Um, what's interesting is if you put on times two, then the sound effects stop. So my thrower's gonna go and get the ball, makes the pickup, goes for the pass, rolls a one to start with, but then gets the pass away. Quite cool. So happy days, I think. Um, it's, it's still one all, but now I've got control of the drive. Well, not control of the drive, I've got the ball, which is not quite the same thing. Uh, let's skip through. Nothing much happens for the next couple of turns, actually. Just a couple of whacks. Um, not worried about this person over here. Um, the guard sidestep, so unless he's going to sort of surround, he's not getting surfed anytime soon. And what he's doing now is putting an absolute load of um, players over one side of the pitch. Um, so I switched it over a bit. Didn't play that turn particularly well, but sort of got away with it there. Um, yeah, with some dodges and stuff. Uh, that was a shame, that was a skull there. Um, so I brought this one round, did the dodge, one dice on his superstar, anything but a skull, and then the skull came. Stunned myself. Could have been worse, because he had a mighty blow. Um, so what happens here? Um, how did he get the blitz? So I was a bit confused by this. Uh, there's a block there. So in a minute, I, did, I didn't entirely watch this turn. Um, so I think this guy's. I think this guy blitzes. Not quite sure what happens. Let's have a look. Because my ball carry gets blitzed. I think. Oh yeah. So block there. Follow up. Who's doing the blitz? Oh, it's this person, is it? Yeah. No. Who's doing the blitz? Ah, uh, that uh, right. Okay, this case where. So was that a dodge? Oh, it was a dodge, cheeky monkey. Ah, uh, the dodge. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, and there's gonna be a go for it in there. So strength five blitz. This is. Um, but we're okay because I can dodge because my Amazon's there. Is the time limit? Over it goes. Uh, side step over there. All right, now this one's a tricky one. Um, tricky turn this. Not quite sure what I, I I thought a little bit before moving on, and I thought what I would try and do is is sort of blast a hole on this side, so um, blitz with the thrower to start with, uh, gets the pow, uh, goes a two dice with the guarder and moves over to there so that this person get the one dice, so that's a pushback. So if that had been a pow, then I'd have followed and built a sort of nice cage. Now that's quite key. See what happens there, one. Reroll one, and that's the game over. Sad times for me. Um, yeah, dodge, snake eyes, and then nothing much happens after that. Um, yeah, then I get beaten up a bit. So if we just wander through, he just duffs me up for his turn, and then runs through and picks up the ball after a couple of go for it's. Uh, needed a reroll for something. Um, yeah, I get both down and fail, and then that's it really. So I'll just I'll just let it play through. But it was it was a it was a good turn, lots lot good game. That's why I sort of made this replay. We had the wizard, we had um, we had the one turn score, which is pretty amazing, um, and then the snake eyes. So that was the sort of three key bits. And uh, what I do, I just click through my uh, click through my turns here. Um, so what happens? Yeah, so he scores, um, and then I've got a turn. I've got my turn 16, so I'm vaguely setting up for the one turner. Um, quick snap might be nice, um, but he gets perfect defence. 
I, I, I wasn't really optimistic of the one turner. Um, I put up something like that to see if I could get. It. I did have a side step, which would have made it easier. Um, but if I got if I got quick snap, it might have been possible. But uh, I didn't. He got perfect defence instead. Um, and so nothing much happens. I bash his people a bit, and then get a bring that guy back. Get a star player point. Hurry. But that was uh, it was a nice game. A little bit on the long side, an hour and forty minutes, which is longer than most fumble games last. Um but I've condensed it a bit and hopefully you enjoyed that one.